All right, guys, welcome back. Let's go through the service tunnel and see what's in here. Maybe some more slime. Do we see the strong lights we can use? Well, actually, no. It's light from the floor. Ah, there is a checkpoint. Should have kept going. It's all good, though. It's like two feet away. Okay, I can finally upgrade. Hey, what's this? It's a new one. Fires adhesive munitions that detonate when manually triggered. Or if the timer expires. Well, we can't do it anyways. We could get our final slot for this, though. Nice. So right now we have on energy gained from headshots. Wait, no, this is pierced aimed fire boost damage while aiming energy renewal from headshots, 35%. Energy gained from headshots. Ammo cost while levitating. I never really levitate and shoot at the same time, but... Oh, no. Damage while aiming. This is a better version of the other one. Zoom? Don't even know what it means, bro. I wish I could just remove these timed things. I'm never going to do it. Oh, might need some light. Or is that just here to light up the place? Any slime? Yeah, right where it's the other side of where we were locked in. Or locked out of. Okay. The third thing. The sound made darker, the darkness made louder. Hartman was stretched like a worm through time. The third thing was a monster. Now we crashed out of darkness toward Faden. So just like Alan Wake, they have the actual actor for him as well. Gotta find the battery for that. There is a light source. Or somewhere to put a light. <laughs> so now someone's mad at Kirkland. Well, everyone's mad at Kirkland for doing the internal investigations. So much I haven't even done yet, I might leave that there to be honest. Let's go ahead and find the battery. Or bring the light. Oh, look at this. Reminder All employees are required to report their hours at the end of each month. The Federal Bureau of Control maintains that time is not subjective and hours passed on alternative planes cannot be claimed. Astral dives do not accumulate overtime compensation. Thank you for your attention. 
That's messed up. Delays caused by how shifts don't count towards overtime. Wow. This is the only light I saw. Eagle Limited Summary. And a train derailment, killing a bunch of people, damn. Oh, new enemy type? Come on, man. Can be a localized manifestation of sentient blank, or it can be a shaded individual, human body, or a shaded object. Mm, it's not what I wanted to hear. My understanding of the darkness is fragmented, incomplete. This abyss, this void, it very much does not wish to be understood. If light symbolizes knowledge, then it stands to reason that darkness would equate to ignorance. By its very nature, it abhors comprehension. Of course, my own nature drives me to comprehend all. We are opposing forces, destined to collide. And given this conflict of natures, we know that the light of truth will burn away the darkness both figuratively and literally. Any significant light source can be used as protection, even weapon mm. against this metaphysical gloom. And then there are the artists. I know for a fact that Tom, Wake, the Anderson brothers, and Lane all had some involvement with the darkness. The question is whether their uncanny ability to affect reality through their art beckons the darkness, or did their work perhaps even create it? With Wake now secure in my lodge, I expect I shall grow closer to learning the answers to these questions. Assuming he cooperates, which is proving quite the challenge. Well, perseverance is the foundation of knowledge. Speaking of, I must be off on my rounds. So we did kidnap him. Alright, we need to find a battery. Can I open this? Can. There's one. There's also another place for a battery downstairs. Just don't know where the other battery is. So NASA uses the black rock in their lining of the space vessels now. Wow. Black market got raided in the Czech Republic by a special investigators. Some of the altered items got uh No, people tried to escape using altered items and ended up dying. It's an underground growing market for paranormal materials. The criminals don't even know what the items do. And the motivations are unknown.
Wasn't they down here and none of this? I guess I didn't see that one. But I saw it while I was up there listening to the recording. Yeah, right here is another spot for uh, a battery. I'm gonna do that first. Let's see what happens. Okay, what's the point? Did it open something new? No. So what did that do? Agent Fisher, day six inside the motel. Utilized surveillance methods are as follows. Fiber optic cameras slid under the individual room doors. Motion detectors in the lobby area. Trip wire triggering a flash camera across the main entrance using fingerprint powder on the front desk. Results are very at best. But mostly just inconclusive and unusable. The footage is corrupted, sometimes even the equipment. So I don't know how exactly. Ghost? I, I think this place is making fun of me. That's the only explanation. I can hear them laughing and screaming behind the closed doors. I can hear the call bell go and ding multiple times a day, but when I look, there's no one there. I know I'm supposed to stay out of sight, but I've seen the doors closing just before I can catch even a glimpse of anyone or anything. They're messing with me, whoever they are. I think... Wait, shh. There's something. I gotta get this... I gotta get the cable out. Come on, you fiber optic fuck! Cooperate! Okay, here we go. That's it. Alright. That was fair, oh. but I did it. Oh, I think I might have finally caught one. Ha! <laughs> the recording better work this time, or I swear to God, I'm... What? Hello? Who's there? It's about to get murked. Oh, shit. I'm with the FBC. Move away from the door. I have a... Where's my... Is it finished? So did, the li did these lights come on because of that battery? And maybe I wouldn't have seen that... If I didn't do this, because I walked through here again and nothing happened. I didn't see any of these things that I found just now. The tape recording was not there. Yeah, I think they turned these lights on. Anyways. No, they're still on. Ah, uh, is that a new enemy? Someone else here. Is 
Where is he? I guess. I don't know why the music was playing for so long. They drop anything? Enemies weren't that bad, they're just regular foot soldiers that can fly now. They basically have the same moves we have. Who's that guy with trench? Is that Kirkland? The hell is that? Place is definitely Something in this darkness is draining me. Possessed. Oh, we need to stay in the, the light, yeah. Is there any battery? Any battery there, battery there. I see a staircase. Can she still fly and stuff? Yeah. Another space for a battery up there. I was definitely supposed to find a light source first. What's this? Finding all kinds of stuff in the darkness. Screenplay. It was found after the Bureau acquired the Night Springs television series and all his past episode scripts to be appears to be written by Alan Wake as a part of an application to become one of the show's writers. Okay, I can't see nothing. At least it doesn't take our uh, our health or our abilities. It just I don't know what she means. When it... Oh, it takes the energy. It does. Do see something above though? Yes, yeah, so that's what it does. Okay. I just didn't realize. Focus on treatment of artists struggling with creative blocks and other mental disorders. He was abusing his patients. Yeah, it's the same guy who uh, took Alan Wake. So after all this time, there's no batteries here. What was that? I saw something. These things like pop up and then they don't. Brian Hennerman, 21 years old, resident of Southern Texas. I'm sorry, ma'am, but I really don't understand why I'm here. You know what you did, Mr. Hennerman. I do. Tell me about delivery disaster. The movie? I don't. I mean, it wasn't very good. That's not what your review said, but we'll come back to that. Tell me where you got the movie from. Movie night with a, you know, a K, not an N, not. Not night, like nighttime, but... Who contacted you? Who told you to review that film? No one. I just did it because it looked obscure. I didn't even like the movie. 
I should not be on such a high score, but reviewing obscure films makes me look smart. And I thought if I looked smart, I would get listeners. My podcast would take off and I could live out of my <laughs> basement. I may even go to college and get a film degree like I've always wanted to. I swear. I swear, I swear, I swear. <sighs> okay, the kid doesn't know shit. I'm in the session. <laughs> Yeah, I think I'm not supposed to be doing this stuff until I find the batteries, but... I couldn't help myself. I found the chest, found some of those things. Shit. What the? Now what? Oh, snap. What is that? Well, he brought the battery. Oh, I can't even take it back up. So where's the other... Something popped up up here. Another one? Okay, this room is really intimidating and all, but I know my rights. It's not a crime to try and get a book signed. Making unauthorized contact with a dangerous paranatural entity is indeed a bureau offense, Mr. Langston, and can be prosecuted as such. Uh, okay. Well, I didn't know that. Listen, this is being way out of proportion. All that happens is I heard Dr. Hartman brought in and since I'm a huge Alan Wake fan, I thought it'd be cool to talk to the creator of the sign. Uh, that's the book that Hart Okay, uh, good. So yeah, I was just looking to fill out my weight collection. I certainly didn't know Hartman had turned into some kind of shadow zombie. That's a completely inaccurate description. Whatever, listen, I'm just a desk job. I source papers, do data entry, that kind of stuff. Don't come down to me like this. Uh, I made one mistake. I mean, I see people break the rules all the time, and no one is pulling them into dark rooms to yell at them. Yesterday, Dave Gleason and his crew were talking to that empty spacesuit and laughing their heads off. We're letting you off with the warning, Mr. Winston. But this is going on your record, so one more screw up in our next chat won't be so friendly. Great. That is just great to hear, guys. Thank you. Thank you so much. Hey, is there any chance I could get my copy of The Creator's Dilemma back? Get out. <laughs> His voice is like switching to like those ghost voices and stuff. Um, so this guy dropped from the top somewhere and he brought the battery with him. Is there some batteries above? Do I like make this guy follow me? I bet you won't come this way. There's some more stuff up there to read too. Okay, so this elevator is not working still, so... I'm not sure what... He's waiting for me to go into the darkness.
hell do I do, bro? I thought I can take this and bring it multiple places. Do I throw it back at him? Activate the light to defeat the creature, but how? There's no other. Oh, are you kidding me? I was here the whole time, bro. It's unbelievable. It wasn't even lighting up, bro. Piece of shit. Um, the other one was above somewhere. It's over there. There's another one up there. Okay. Is it? Oh, just I just went in there, I guess. Where's the other one? Destroyed, nigga. Oh, he's gonna find a way to escape, of course. Yeah, how do you like that? So before that happened, I saw a bunch of other stuff popping up. Here. Oh, I got it. This is another recording. Brian Hennerman, 21 years old, resident of. Did I get this one already? I'm sorry, ma'am, but I really don't understand why I'm here. You know what you did, Mr. Hennerman. I don't think so. Tell me about Delivery Disaster. The movie? I don't. I mean, it wasn't very good. That's not what your review said, but we'll come back to that. Tell me where you got the movie from. Movie night with a, you know, okay. Oh, I did hear this one. Not. Okay, I feel, I feel like I saw more things lighting up in the darkness. They were on shelves like that, though. Guess that's it. This should be working now. Just checking the map, see if it lines up. I'm gonna have to go straight ahead. Man, what are you doing in investigations? Jesus, don't scare me like that, Winston. 
If you're talking right now, I can't hear you. It's a one-way system. Try to find an intercom. Langston, it's me, Jesse. I know. I can see you on the monitors. The cameras in there haven't worked since we sealed that sector off a couple years back. Let me guess. You sealed it because of the monster guy. Wait, did you see Dr. Hartman? Oh, that's Dr. Jeez, Hartman. I really wish you hadn't opened that fire break. Okay, listen, you need to find Hartman and kill him before he gets out into the Bureau. That thing is a person? He was a person. We brought him here to study after he was, uh, oh, altered in an AWE. I forget the medical word for what happened, but now light physically hurts him. Do you have a flashlight? No. Uh, a lantern? Headlamp? Oh, yeah, flare gun. Oh, Christmas lights. You could wrap them around your- I don't have any of those, Langston. Shit. Okay, uh, well, I'm sure you'll think of something. Wow. I'll keep an eye on you from the Panopticon. This is kind of exciting, right? Maybe from where you're standing. <laughs> For real. Right. Okay, well, uh, break a leg. Oh, why did I say that? Okay, this Hartman thing can't have gotten very far. Let's go flush him out. Right. Hmm. Langston was right. This is kind of exciting. It's just nice to have someone to talk to, you know? No, he's going to be talking the whole time. Charge of the Panopticon, people treat me different, like I'm crazy for wanting to work with altered items. You can go left, right, or people straight. People don't understand the altered items like I do, you know? I don't want to brag, but it does take a very empathetic mind to connect with the items. Doesn't Still, want I don't to know brag. Why people are making it so personal. <laughs> right. I mean, the teams in research handle paranatural materials every day, and no one thinks they're weird. Well, maybe that's not true, darling. Please tell me he's not going to yap the entire time. When he's weird, it's charming. Altered items really aren't that frightening once you get to know them. If you figure out what they like or don't like, you know, what sets them off, then there's nothing to worry about. I guess at the end of the day, we're still just wild animals scared of our own shadows. We're supposed to be on the same team, but sometimes it feels like it's every department for themselves, like it's a race, and we're all trying to be number one. If it is a race, though, I'd say Darling is a mile ahead of everyone else. He was Trench's golden boy for years, but that relationship has gotten oh, look at this. tense, or so I've heard through the grapevine. Not that I spread rumors, just, you know, people talk. Not me, though. I keep my nose to the grind. Too much work to do to focus on those kinds of things. I need to stay focused so I can get my work done and get home to feed Alfred. He's of course, just talk for I always make it home for meal time, so I have Alright, she said it anyways, guys. I think we're gonna go ahead she this way first. Nice. Her name is Maria. And come back right here, go left and right, and clear this place out. So always leave me a like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.